give God our best time. Matthew 6 33 says, But seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added to you. So often we give God leftover time. We work hard, come home and get involved with family events or our own pursuits. And if there is a little time before bed, we might say a prayer. That is what I call leftover time. It is putting God last on the list. God ought to be first. So, good stewardship of time means giving the best time of our day to God and others. My suggestion, make an appointment with God each day, just like you would with the doctor. It is much easier to keep an appointment when we have it written down. I too had placed God last in my life and would go to him like an, an ATM machine. I no longer put God last. I put him first in my life. I give him my concerns because I know he is the master solver. So today, I want to encourage you to put God first in your life. Before you call a friend to lament about your problem, call God. Call God first and he will answer you. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, today I give you all my problems. I put you first in my life and not last. Help me to call upon you, Jesus, before I pick up that phone and call a friend and lament about my problems. Help me to trust you, knowing that you will solve my problems, Jesus. Help me to believe. Help my unbelief. Take out my Thomas spirit. Doubting Thomas. Thomas doubted you, Jesus. But you proved to him that you are the real deal. So today, Lord, I'm asking you to take over my mind, my thoughts, everything that would allow me to put you last because I want to put you first in my life. Thank you, God. This is my humble prayer. In your precious name, I pray. Amen and amen. Have a blessed day from my now ministries.